Okay, so let us start the session. Today I am going to discuss about uh, the blueprint of uh, uh, Maths Standard Term 1 Sample Paper which, which was issued uh, yesterday by CBSE. So let us start uh, with the general instruction. Uh, the whole paper is divided into three sections. The section 1, section 1 contains uh, of 20 questions. Okay, it consists 20 questions of one mark each that means 20 marks but it is not 20 marks any 16 questions are to be attempted not all okay and first 16 questions uh, will be uh, taken as a uh, final the first 16 attempt now section b also uh, it consists of 20 questions of one mark each and in that section also you have to attempt any 16 questions right and the last section is of case study questions. Two case study questions will be there. It's five questions in each case study. And uh, the, all the students have to attempt four questions from each case study. That means uh, eight questions. Out of ten, eight questions uh, the student have to attempt it. So all together, 50 questions are there. But students uh, have to attempt only uh, 40 questions. 16 questions from section A, 16 questions from section B, and 10, eight questions from section C. So now let us uh, uh, move towards the uh, uh, section chapter wise distribution of uh, marks with respect to the sample paper. So uh, first uh, and this is a very important uh, point there is no negative marking. So actually jo OMR sheet mein jo objective papers jo exam jo uh, attempt karte hai, usme negative marking hai. but here there is no negative marking. Right. So this is the split of uh, first chapter that is uh, uh, unit number system. Section A mein 4 questions hain or section B mein 3 questions hain. All together 7 questions are there or 7 marks. But unit ka jo weightage hai as per split up syllabus of term, term by syllabus is of 6 marks. So don't think that ki zyada hai kyunki ye optional hai. Right. So you can attempt all the 7 questions from real numbers all, only. So that is optional. Now second unit is algebra. Two chapters are there polynomials and pair of linear equation. Polynomial uh, in standard only six questions are there. One mark ka section B mein aur five, ek uh, case study question hai. All five questions but only four questions have to attempt. So all uh, six marks total ho gaya. Vaisi, uh, linear equation mein three marks section A aur three marks section B. 6. So total 12 questions are there. Okay, so 12 questions, 12 marks, but the weightage of unit is 10 marks according to the term by syllabus. Right, now we'll move toward the next unit, coordinate geometry. Coordinate geometry is a very easy chapter uh, because only two sections are there, distance formula and section formula, and we have uh, 9 questions. Okay, section A 1 question, section B may 3 questions hai, or Case study questions ek hai, usme se char attempt karne hai. So total 9 questions hai, right? All 9 questions uh, cannot be attempted because yaha pe ek choice hai, yaha pe. Only 4 questions you can attempt. Ye pura attempt kar sakte ho. That means the student can attempt 8 questions from coordinate geometry. And the weightage of this unit is only 6 marks. So this is a very scoring uh, chapter where student can score 8 marks by attempting 8, question, eight questions. 4 questions from case study questions and 1 from section A and uh, 3 questions from section B. Right. So now next uh, unit is introduction to trigonometry. So here pe 4 mark, A section mein 4 questions hai aur B section mein 3. So 7 questions hai 7 marks and the weightage of this chapter is 5 marks. Right. And uh, now we'll move towards geometry triangles. Section A may 5 questions hai or section B may 1 question. So all together 7 questions, 7 marks. And the weightage of this unit is actually 6 marks according to the term by syllabus. Right. And uh, the next unit is mensuration areas related to circles. And I am very surprised to see that only 4 questions are there, 4 marks. And the unit weightage is also 4 marks. So yahan pe koi choice nahi hai but the student uh, uh, can uh, leave this chapter. A chapter bilkul chhod sakte hain. Kaise? Because they have to attempt only 40 questions out of 50 questions. Right? So I will tell what, which chapter the student have to concentrate more. 
okay now probability this is the last uh, chapter only four questions are there two questions from section a two questions for section b and uh, total four marks and the weightage of unit is uh, three marks according to the term wise syllabus so now we'll move towards the uh, uh, blueprint of the question paper so this is the blueprint uh, and uh, the student may decide the chapter to practice uh, more uh, according to me these chapters are very easy where i'm marking okay real numbers polynomials coordinate geometry even triangles are also easy areas related to circles probability if an average student will concentrate on this uh, uh, only six chapters he can score very good marks see 7 6 13 plus 9 22 14 18 22 plus 7, 29 or 8, 37 marks to ICI again. But there is no choice if you uh, if you will prepare only six, this three uh, six chapters. So this is the blueprint of uh, maths uh, standard, right? So now we will discuss about the basic paper, right? Uh, wait, I will show the uh, sample paper also. So this is the sample paper of uh, CBSE, which was uh, which is. Uh, Uh, published yesterday only, yesterday evening. So first question, section A, my jo first question is this is from real numbers, and this is from linear equation in two variables. This type of question we did uh, from triangles chapter MCQ. करते समय किए थे, and this also length of diagonals of rhombus, then length of altitude of the rhombus. This type of question also we did triangles chapter, and uh, fifth question from probability, sixth question from triangles, seventh question from trigonometry. and uh, eighth question again real numbers ninth question linear equation in two variable tenth question coordinate geometry and the eleventh question again real numbers twelfth question also from real numbers lcm hcf and thirteenth uh, question from trigonometry and fourteenth question from triangles okay and fifteenth uh, question number of revolution ye areas related to circles ka hai and uh, the sixteenth question again from triangle and uh, 17th question uh, from triangle and 18th question from trigonometry ye wala question hum log class mein kiye the yaad hai yes yes sir right and this question also we did in the class 5x plus 7y priti yahan pe doubt puchi thi maine 2 aur minus 2 ka example liya tha so agar 15 hoga to 3 aur minus uh, 3 se into karke check karenge maine kaha tha do you remember priti yes sir yes and uh, this is probability probability se question hai section b first question dekho hcf or sum of two numbers diya hua hai so this is uh, from uh, first chapter real numbers and 22nd linear equation and 23rd trigonometry ye wala aisa wala ek question kiye hain hum log and 24th linear equation in two variables 25th real numbers and uh, 26th probability 27th bhi probability ka hai aur 28th jo hai wo ट्रिग्नोमेट्री uh, है और ट्वेंटी नाइन्थ जो है कोऑर्डिनेट ज्योमेट्री थर्टी एथ ट्राइंगल थर्टी फर्स्ट अगेन कोऑर्डिनेट ज्योमेट्री यहाँ पे थोड़ा कुछ लोगों को कन्फ्यूजन क्या है कि यहाँ पे देखो लीनियर इक्वेशन टू वेरिएबल दिया हुआ है राइट सो कई लोग इसको लीनियर इक्वेशन एंड टू वेरिएबल का क्वेश्चन uh, इसको काउंट करके चले एक्चुअल में यहाँ पे क्या दिया हुआ है द इक्वेशन ऑफ द परपेंडिकुलर बाई ऑफ द लाइन ज्वाइनिंग ए एंड बी सो so, इसमें से जो लाइन है जो करेक्ट लाइन है वो इसके मिड पॉइंट से पास होगा इज दैट क्लियर सो फर्स्ट वी हैव टू फाइंड द मिड पॉइंट देन सब्सटीट्यूट द वैल्यू जिसको सेटिस्फाई कर रहा है दैट इज द करेक्ट आंसर सो ये कोऑर्डिनेट ज्योमेट्री का है नाउ थर्टी सेकेंड ट्रिग्नोमेट्री थर्टी थर्ड डेसिमल एक्सपेंशन टर्मिनेट्स दिस रियल नंबर्स थर्टी फोर्थ अगेन ट्राइंगल्स थर्टी फिफ्थ रेशियो कॉर्डिनेट ज्योमेट्री This is from areas related to circle. This is also areas related to circle. Two and half are the zeros. This is polynomial. This is from polynomial, and uh, this is from areas related to circle. Number of solutions. ये linear equation का है. And case study questions. Now this is an example from. Uh, this is question from polynomial chapter, and this question is from coordinate geometry. So this is the last question. दोनों केस स्टडी क्वेश्चन में फाइव फाइव क्वेश्चन हैं कोई एक अटेम्प्ट करना है राइट नाउ आई एम मूविंग टूवर्ड्स 
the blueprint so this is the blueprint i will share uh, in your class group okay so that's all for today's session thank you thank you very much